<laughs> Good afternoon, YouTube. Hey, this is my 2020 load trail, 26 foot full tilt bed equipment trailer. Now, I'm uh, having a little issues. Man, my toolbox is full, which is they don't really give you a whole lot of space. So, you know, the thing is, is I always used to pile the chains in the corner. I got eight chains and then plus everything else that I want to carry. So I need more storage. So I was doing a little shopping on Craigslist and I came across this gem. Now this is a swivel toolbox, 36 by 18. It was actually too big to go under the bed because it's 18 inches, over 18 inches wide. So I put her up on, had her welded on there. But uh, once I removed this light, I really like it for the fact is if you're going to fill a toolbox, instead of stacking everything on top of each other, you've got three separate drawers that are heavy duty. And you can actually fill it up and get access to it. So that is in the works. But I got a little hack here. I was at um, Harbor Freight and uh, they had some bags on sale and I thought about, you know, what to do with, what to do with all my chains. I mean, so what I'm doing currently is that it's stack them in the corner. Now when it comes to take them out, it's such a pain in the ass. So this is a 20 foot, three eighths, grade eight, five sixteenths hooks. And I bought one just to try it out. But um, I picked up a 30, 30 millimeter ammo can and uh watch this you wouldn't think about it 20 foot chain set it in there feed it back and forth <laughs> look at that perfect fit now all my chains are going in boxes. And as for what, um, for the way they are, I mean, they're not taking up any more space being in that ammo can versus just piled up in the box. So I got eight chains and uh, I got over eight cans. And then I bought, um, The big old strap, 40 pieces, 40, 40 straps. That way I can, I'm gonna start bungeeing these up so that when you put them in there, I'll just wrap those around there. That way they won't uncoil. But um, that's all I got going on. But uh, definitely love the way that those chains fit in those boxes. And if you look at this, there's your load trail. So this is your box. Anytime it's winter, I mean, you could put a magnet over there or something to a flat to try to keep the water out. But man, that gets wet and your chains are always wet. But um, ammo boxes got a rubber seal. If I need a chain, I grab a box. Stack them all up in there. They're gonna be dry. I love it. <laughs> I bought 10 of them. So, I'll keep you posted. I'll have some more load trail trailers. I'll do a review here um, in the in the future. But like I say, I actually put in the Bulldog electric jack or the electric motor for the jacks. So um, no more hand cranking. Like I say, when I go get that, I'll get that posted. Oh, I love it. You know, it doesn't go as fast as hydraulic, but it sure takes no effort to um, push that button as it goes up or down. So, oh, tractor supply, 12,000 pound winch. 
definitely pulls things up there. Why buy a Ramsey, man? Over double the cost. Get your use out of this one. All right, that's all I got today. Low trail, Harbor Freight, love the star. Talk to you later, bye.